Jed, I hope you go easy on me here. I haven't done an in-person interview in like more than a year. Um, ride the wave. Sure. Define that for me. What does that mean for you? Yeah, I mean, uh, I think for me it's just, uh, you know, l trying to be as consistent and steady as possible, right? Because the game's going to provide that, um, that, that up and down, right? And so you just got to stay on your board, so to speak, and, uh, and ride the ups and downs. I've been dying to ask you this for a long time. Yeah. It's such a simple question. Sure. Why do you hit so many doubles? <laughs> Uh, because I, I hit a lot of barrels on the bat, and I'm not strong enough to hit a bunch of homers here in Oakland. <laughs> okay, but honestly, like, I, I would think that you're either a really speedy player, your leg, you're stretching a single into a double, or I think in your case, you're just finding gaps. I mean, you honestly hit a lot of stand-up doubles, too. Sure. Yeah, no, I, I think that's kind of the point, right? Like, as I, um, you know, I hit a, I hit a lot of balls uh, on the line. Um, and that's kind of the approach, right? Stay gap to gap. And, um, you know, they, they when they find the gap, you know, it's, uh, they tend to be doubles. It's been um, a week and a half of good stuff for Bob Melvin, the wins record yeah. in Oakland. And then just yesterday, exactly 10 years at yeah. this job of being the manager and i know you've had a couple tour duties here with them sure. you understand what he's all about what why is he good for you why what in your opinion what makes him good at what he does yeah i mean i i really appreciate his uh his ability to, um, you know, just let guys be themselves. Um, you know, he has a very high standard. He has very high expectations for guys. Um, but, but past, you know, doing the little things like showing up on time, giving your best effort, um, and you know, knowing that everything that we do in the clubhouse, that every move he makes is about winning. Um, he lets you, he lets you be yourself, and, and I think that's something that, uh, you know, allows guys to perform at their best. If you were to take off your hat right now, is there the little card in there which tells you how to play every hitter on the opposition? Know, there, there might have been. <laughs> Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Okay. But, but you would have, if you catch me at a different time, probably would have been. I mean, when you came into the major leagues, I don't know that every team was doing it to sure. this extent. Sure. How do you feel sometimes, and especially you on the right side of the infield, sure. you have a shortstop on your side a lot. It's, right. it's different than when you came in to this level. Yeah, you know, I listen, I, I think it's um, from a strategic standpoint, it makes perfect sense. You know, it, there used to be a, it used to be an advantage to be a left handed hitter. Now it's probably a disadvantage. Um, and, you know, they, these guys are, are getting a lot smarter in the sense of, um, you know, knowing where you're going to hit the ball and not just by using spray charts too i mean there's there's more sophisticated stuff being used like to analyze guys swings and i think the the better teams pitch to the shift as well where you know they throw you pitches if you put your a swing on it you're going to hit into the shift hey last thing i mean we talked about you a lot on the post game show and, and what a great story i think it is i mean you missed two full seasons sure. essentially now to come back and like you didn't even miss a beat not to you know brag or whatever i know you're a humble guy but sure. don't you feel like this has been a great storyline for you and, and yeah. it's just been a great rejuvenation here again in oakland no doubt about it i, I mean that's uh, uh just having the ability to come back and and play and and you know i, I think uh you know first and foremost too, like to, to get out here you know I have two young kids and for them like they're now at the ages where they can kind of appreciate it um, I, I think having that ability to come out here and play um, where they can you know see me and and um, enjoy it with me um, or and I can enjoy it with them uh, makes all the difference Stanford's own Jed Lowry appreciate it Jed. all right thanks guys